everybody. It is Tuesday morning, day number like 85 here in California. Brennan just declared this might be one of the best breakfast plates he's ever made. A little Frenchy toasty, a little fruity salad. That, yeah, excellent. All right, so this is the last day of water polo tournament. It has been four days of water polo tournaments, and today we will play one more game. We're gonna try to run around and see some other water polo as well as we can while we're here because it's super duper fun. And this is the bastion of water polo. But in the meantime, this is where we're eating our breakfast, right here in our hotel. All right, we'll catch up with you. Let me know what we're doing. I didn't get, I didn't get Brennan, let Brennan say anything. Well, you've been eating. Is that okay? I Bye. Mm. Oh. Yeah, I have to win this game today. You have to win this game today? All right, let's do it. That'd be good. So what is your, um, do you have any particular plan? Any particular motivational speech you'll be giving? Nope, just keep doing the same thing. Right. Sounds good. This stuff comes from clouds. Water? That's how smart it makes. Yes, you didn't know water was in clouds. I think all water comes from clouds. Well, it depends where you start. It's a, it's a vicious cycle. I think it starts in the ocean. Goes to the cloud, comes back down the ocean, down the mountain. All right, so we're sitting in the car, wasting a teensy bit of time before our next game, our first game of the day, last game of the tournament. So we're very excited for this. We're hoping we win this last game. If not, that's A-OK. -okay. We're gonna go to the beach regardless. And it has been an awesomely oh, fun experience. Only winners get to go to the beach. Oh, okay. Okay, what do the losers get to do? Fly home. They get to work out. They get to, that's a good idea. They, they, they go to the gym that's they what we'll tell them. They stay in the gym and we provide them with food and they stay in there until they each can bench press 150 pounds. I They're love not flying them. home until they can all bench press. Uh, that's pretty good. Yeah. Ooh. All right, so here we go. We're gonna go in there. I'm not sure what Brennan or what Ryan and Katie and Daddy O are doing. Oh, I think Daddy's working. Katie had gymnastics. Ryan had swimming, but I'm not exactly sure what they're doing right now. So maybe we'll get to go over to them if they remember to vlog. If not, you'll see us again. Why is Callaway for a sponsor yet? <laughs> you shamelessly ask everybody for a sponsor. Shout out to Callaway, yo. I'm wearing your hat. I'll wear it more. I'll, this is a one-time thing. I'm gonna say, yo, Callaway. I like your hats. I like your products. I like to play golf. Hit me up with the sponsorship. I will help you to help me. You will help me, I'll help you. <laughs> if anyone watching this related to Callaway, just tag Callaway in the comments if you can. I don't know if they have anything social media, but. I think we should hit up Calvin Klein. I think Brennan should be a Calvin Klein model. Comment Klein. below if you think Brennan like should be a Calvin Nike. Klein model. Nike? By the way, I'm wearing Nike shorts. Shout out to Nike. <laughs> if you guys want to sponsor me, I'm helping you. you can okay, so this is a shameless commercial for Smart Water, Callaway, Calvin Klein. Shout out to Smart Water. You Nike. guys have three. I want to do it for the bed. I don't like when people do this. You know, like when people watermark flip. Oh, that's bad. Yeah, even right. if I am the one. Don't do it. Dad, I just got. That's one. a. I two in a row. Dad. Last one. Dad, Dad, no, you gotta let him keep going until it falls. Because really? this is. Yeah. Three, three. Four. Ryan, hurry up. Don't make a big deal out of it. Five. Five. This is insane. Oh. I can't Five tell you. Row. That deserves close to a lot of likes. I can't tell you how much I dislike that. Come on, that deserves... Making more waffles. Yeah, that deserves a lot of news. Okay, waffles. we're trying to decide what we're doing today. And Dad said he was going to go swimming. An hour and a half ago. That's called procrastination, and I'm not going to do it. I'm going to go You're right You're very now. good at it. So when I get back, we so will. So I. I think I probably should major in procrastination. That's, well, we, let's yeah, decide that later. <laughs> I'll think about it later. <laughs> All right. Um, how was practice today? It was good. Great. And your head feels better? Yes. Great. Okay. That makes me happy. Boom. Boom. Did you do any um, appetizers or any... Um, no. no. I did not do shavashis today. God bless you. Look, it's so detailed. That's a lie. I did. I did Maloney's today. God bless you. But I did not do Takacha. Huh. Takacha! Maloney sounds like a, like a dessert. I'd like three Maloney's, please. Yeah, Kristen Maloney sounds like um cannoli. <laughs> that's, I think that's what you're thinking. What is a Maloney? It's where you do a toe shoot and release and touch the highway. Toe shoot? You just take your toe and shoot it. Boom! Off the camera now. <laughs>
<laughs> I gotta have the chat by toe. All right, so we, we can't decide what we're gonna do. Where are we gonna get pizza and And then we're gonna go on the boat later. Or are we gonna uh, get some, do some steaks? Probably some steaks. All right. But you should go to the pool. Again. All right, I'm gonna go do that in a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> and then you finish your homework yep. in a little while. Yep. And then it'll be. Maybe o'clock. later though. Yeah. All right, I'll go do that. When we get back, we'll decide what we're gonna have. Maybe we should have steak. All right, fire it up. All right, it's pregame. Brennan's got the group all together, giving some last-minute instruction. Pep talk. Yeah. Right, right. You or something. Both. Exactly. This is great. Love it. Bye guys. Bye guys. Alright, this has been on Brennan's list since we got here. Being able to play basketball at Laguna Beach and he's with his peeps and some other guys have joined in as well. So we've got some water polo friends and some other people playing basketball on Laguna Beach. That is pretty idyllic. Look. We caught up with Ian and Ryan again Hi, at Ian. Ice Cream. Ian's back. Hi, Ian. All right, and these four boys have been talking water polo you know, for, I don't know, two, three hours now? We keep trying to leave. It's late at night in Laguna Beach. We had to, hi, Ryan. Hi, guys. Hi, Liam. And so we are calling it a night, I think. We're gonna try. 
we eat ice cream and then we're trying to leave. But see, they keep talking. <laughs> they just keep talking. I went through the They definitely. Hey, how are you, Gwen? Hi, buddy. She had a lot of ice cream today and chocolate was all over her face, but it's since been cleaned off. Look at those cute braces she has. How long are you going to have those, Gwen? A year. A year? Do they hurt? No. No. Do you have to turn any like knobs or anything? Do you have to put rubber bands in? Not yet. Headgear? No. No, you have to hook yourself up to the television every once in a while? No. Okay. All right. Good. All right. Excellent. They look great. I know. You look like a teenager. What the heck? Well, actually, I'm going to need to get another set. Oh, do you get them off and then get another one on? Yes. Nice. Have you had any colors? Yeah. What colors did you choose? This time I blue and green. Blue and green. Very nice. That's some good summer colors. Kind of beachy, actually. Swim team colors. Oh, sure. Oh, I see. I see. How is swim team going? Yes. What is your favorite stroke? Yes. Nice. And what are the events you usually swim? Do you swim like the 50 fly? Do you swim like the 100 breaststroke? Do you swim the 14 frog? What the what? The 25. The 25 freestyle? And fly. Are you finished with swimming or do you still have more swimming? I still have more swimming. We have our medal meets this weekend. Yeah. 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 Same deal? Yeah. yeah. All right, we gotta get back. You gotta get to bed. You got a yes. lot of swimming to do. We do. All right, <laughs> bye, Gwen. <laughs> okay, so Gwen and I are at the hotel. We've switched hotels for the night. We're only staying here one night for like five hours. So do we come to the hotel? Okay, we come to the hotel room. Wait, do you have a key? No. Stay in. Stay in. No. And it's this like, it's it's a room, like the door is different than all the other Okay, so we walk in and we're like, what is happening here? There's a kitchen and a bathroom and like this whole living room set up and like windows. And there's no bedroom. Like, but there's no bedroom. We can't, like these windows, look how big, like these windows go on for days, right? There's, but we can't find a bedroom. We're not exactly sure. I think we might have to sleep on the couch. So we tried this door, right? Wait, check your card again. 1758. So it says my name here. See, it's just that 1758 as well. I wonder if that is also. What's that? <laughs> I'm not sure what to do because there's not really a bedroom. And you guys, by the way, my camera, I left it in the car. And the parking lot is, the parking garage is like an hour away. So I'm filming on my phone right now. So <laughs> First of all, what? Well, does it pull out? I hope so. I'm so tired. I think Brennan and I have to share a bed. <laughs> well, I might why have... did they make this without a bedroom? I don't know. Like, I think that's the bedroom. But I'm not sure how to get in it. You can download the Marriott Mobile app to chat directly with the host. Should we call the front desk and ask them where the bedroom is? Yeah. Do you want to do that? Okay, I spoke with the front desk. There is no bedroom. <laughs> it's either the pull-out couch or some real... I don't know. It's weird. Why would you want this room? I think because you want it because it attaches to that bedroom over there, which would be really cool, except for the fact... and then. Also, the other bedroom outside, you know, if you wanted to use it as a living room for a suite or something. But they didn't tell us that when we checked in just a few minutes ago past midnight. So they're setting up two rollaway beds. So let's get Jamie's on, brush teeth, all that stuff, get ready to go to bed. Sound good? I'm just going to bed now. Okay. We're here on the couch? Yuck.
All right, what made you happy today? Made me happy today was probably. Oh, what, why is it in so far like this? Okay, okay. What made me happy today was um. <laughs> paparazzi. <laughs> um, getting a good workout at some practice this morning, and. <laughs> Oh, what else? That, oh, yeah. And hanging out with my friends, Christian and Matthew. Oh, that's um, great. Ryan, are you go what, what meet are you going to? What metal meet? Oh, uh, the silver. I tried to make it in the gold my last fly thing, and then the uh, the time you had to get to get into the gold meet was, I'm pretty sure, like a 3860. No. I think it was a 38 flat. No. Somewhere around the 38. And I got a. Um, Thirty-nine seventy-five. Oh. So. Second place is first loser. <laughs> <laughs> right, I no, think okay. you're a winner. Hey, good job. Hey, um, hey. so basically, guys, there's the medal meets, which is basically gold, bronze, and silver. So like, you have to qualify certain times to get into those meets. Yeah. So after all the summer swim meets are over as a team, then you're competing for yourself. So it's like you're trying to beat your own times and your own records at the medal meets. So Ryan's going to the silver meet, so it goes gold is the best, silver, second best, and bronze is like the nice job you made it. So like, <laughs> yeah. Congratulations to you, Congrat are you going to be in any of those? No, okay, so here's the deal. You got to compete in at least three meets. Oh. I only did two. Oh. Wow. Oh, this thing. Can I nice shirt? This thing, thanks. This is one, that Katie's shirt? Yeah, we need a little shirt swap. <laughs> Whoa, whoa. I, I got Katie's shirt and she got mine. How are you guys? All right. What made you happy today, Kate? Um, I did um, Jaeger drills did at drill. the gym today. What are those? It's a skill where you like Jaeger? swing. Or, like the drill I did was you swing and then like you swing backwards. On the bar? Yeah. Okay. So like you extend and you kick your heels up in the back, so that you can uh, like release the bar, flip and catch. Yep. But that's the drill I was doing. But the actual skill, you do cast handstand backwards grip and then you swing flip catch. I so, don't think a lot of people know what that is, but but you it's did those. Just a crazy yeah, bar. but I was doing the drill where you swing. And that made me happy today. Yeah. Awesome. So man, this right. this swing track can make a pretty good. Comment, Comment below what made you guys happy today, today, and we'll see you tomorrow. There you go. Boom. Uh, you want to share what made you happy today, baby? There's a lot of fun stuff done today. I'm out with Mark. Oh, how great. So what you guys don't know is, so whoop, yeah, I eat. since we last saw you, we went over to another hotel where Brennan's old coach, his previous water polo coach, was staying because he's out here for the Junior Olympics as well. So we had an awesome opportunity to spend about 45 minutes with him. He now lives in Texas, so he's far, far away, but we had a great time with Mark, his old water polo coach. But he also, Brennan also won a water polo game today. We saw lots of other great water polo. We went to the beach with his friends, played basketball, drank milkshakes, saw some of our water polo friends from another team. We had a great, great, great day. So comment below, you guys, what made you happy, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.